Hello whiskey lovers and welcome to another one of Mark's Whiskey Ramblings. Today we are in the ancient city of Laval, a city in France in the department of Mayenne, which was actually founded in 1020 and behind me you can still see parts of the ramparts that surrounded the old city of Laval. It is a well-known city for silk and cotton, but today it has turned into an industry of uh, uh, synthetic textiles. All of that just to tell you what a beautiful city we are in. And in this city, we will discover our next beautiful bottle of whiskey. But enough already with the history lessons, because of course we are here to taste whiskey. And in this case, we're going to try the North British 14-year-old from Signatry. Now, the independent bottler Signatry is led by the very amicable Andrew Symington. They've been at it since 1988, and they even built their own bottling plant in Edinburgh in the 1990s. The, same, the name, uh, the name Signatry, is an idea from Andrew and his brother Brian. They originally had the idea to have every bottling signed by a celebrity. Now this never happened, but the name was kept. In my humble opinion, it's a good idea, because Signatory is a very strong name. They've got several ranges, such as the, uh, the Unchill Filtered Collection, the Silent Stills, the Preston Field, but their best known range is probably this one, the Cask Strength Collection, which comes in these fantastic decanters. Now, at a, first, at a festival in Belgium, I was able to chat with Andrew Symington, and I came away with the idea that he is both very, very knowledgeable about whiskey, well, that goes with the territory, I suppose, but he is also a very shrewd businessman. He knows a lot about whiskey, and his company, Signatory, purchased the Edradour distillery in Pitlochry in 2002. Now, to be completely honest, and I've told Mr. Symington this when we met, I'm not very fond of Edward Hour and his, well, his signatory bottlings are hit and miss. Let's find out if this North British is a hit or a miss. North British is not a single malt, it is a single green. The North British distillery can be found near Edinburgh, the capital of Scotland. This is a North British 14-year-old. It was distilled in 1991 and it matured for 14 years on a very special cask. This one matured on a Californian sherry cask and it yielded 629 bottles. This is at cask strength, obviously, it's the cask strength collection, and it was bottled at an ABV of 53.3%. All right then, more British, here we go. A bright golden color, it's the original color, no coloring is added here. Clings nicely to the glass, revealing a full body on the nose. Oh, fresh. Very fruity. I get loads of vanilla, freshly got, cut grass, buttercups. I get a touch of oak. It's upholstered with apricots and, and rhubarb. And there's even some banana all the way in the background, slowly coming to the fore. Oh, this is a very nice nose. I love it already. On the palate, then. Mm. Oily, feisty. That's the high ABV. It's very sweet and very peppery. In this case, loads of green banana. It's even a little, a little rum-like. Creamy, though. Very nice. And the finish is medium long on sherry, vanilla and banana. Well, it's not overly complex, but it is well balanced. It's wonderfully sweet and very tasty. And I'm sure that this would go well with any type of dessert. North British, 14 year old, 1991 from Signatory. Overall, a very nice whiskey, typical for dessert. I love it. And that, my friends, is all for this whiskey rambling from the medieval town of Laval in France. Until we meet again, until the next Whiskey Rambling, may the malt be with you. Bye bye.